All right, take two of the mud hog. I don't know if I'm gonna show the videos where we slid this out the first time. We had to fight it and sand it down so that the uh, thing would slide because the paint was holding it. I don't know if I'm gonna show that or not. So it should slide out easier this time. Got a better idea of what we're doing. And uh, yeah, we got our parts that we were missing. A couple hoses, bolts, brackets. And then these are the main things, the two hydraulic blocks. So, it's windy. It rained a few times this morning, so the beans were gonna be tough, so we figured let's get it over with. We probably want to get the pallet forks under here for when it pops. Oh, it pops. Oh, no, go up just a touch, I think, or down one of the two. I'm pinched now. There it goes. Yeah, we're going to want to get the pallet forks just to catch it. Can you bring, a, bring those blocks just a little bit this way, man? The bottom one, the bottom one. A little bit. There you go. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, if you just pull under there. Jump a little bit. Yeah, you're almost out. Just give it a little bit of here. Help you out. Oh, there she is. She's out. A little more. She's out. There, it dropped. Woo! Yeah, she's out. If that only took like 10 minutes, 15 minutes tops. Curl back. Stop a second. Last time it took like an hour or hour and 15 minutes. goes to show you that you don't need that thing painted up. It's all greased up. That's why it went so nice. We'll just spin them on there till they're snug so we know it works and then we'll tighten them down good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Almost, just gotta clean it out. shouldn't sit at such an angle it helps it sit down a little more so it's on I missed the sliding it on there's a lot of guys came to help slide it on and well, one guy came and it went on really fast and I didn't have the camera so and then we had to run for parts and by the time we got the parts it was dark we worked on some hoses the new block there and then there's one 
can't quite see it. Let's see. Is it? It's up there on the top of that. So the two new blocks, the hoses, down under here. <clears throat> and we got one of the tires on. Just huge. 18430s. Way bigger than the other ones we had on here, but we moved this block up, you can see, so that it uh the combine's gonna sit about the same. A little little bit more lean forward, but not much. So we're just working on this is kind of worn out. Either gonna tighten that or replace that one of the two. And then we gotta put the electrical switch into the cab. And this tire on. And then uh, we're missing one of these. They didn't send them with, and uh, the ones that were on there were froze up pretty good. It's, we got this one. It's a battle, but we got it. And then the other one wouldn't move so we heated it up a little bit and we twisted it off so we got one getting shipped here hopefully in the next day or two so just watch for leaks you're going to try to fill the system Seems to go. 